we are satisfied. It was best election ever conducted in Nigeria. Music sent appeal message to Biden. Welcome to the news and please subscribe to our channel to get notified when we post hot juicy news update. Please click on the notification bell. The Miracle Concern Miracle has sent a message to the United States President Joe Biden pleading with him to compare Nigeria's demonstration in front of the White House against the presidential election in Nigeria to cynical, deluded, and fanatical Republicans who continue to believe that Trump won the U.S. election. This was stated by American Executive Director Prof. Ishak Akintola in a statement made on Monday in Abuja. Prof. Akintola, a few, stated, and I quote, A few misquoted, a few misguided Nigerians have staged a protest in front of the White House and the United States of America against the outcome of the election that was held in Nigeria on February 25th. This is not what should have happened, as the election was the best and most credible that Nigeria has ever had. We request, we request that Joe Biden, the United States President, disregard the protesters because they are uninformed. In significant parts, the election was free and fair. Those who complain about the election are simply aggressive individuals looking to line their own pockets at the expense of other people. Even though our system is not yet, as, is not yet flawless, it is neither undemocratic nor cruel. In, in actuality, it was the most flawlessly run poll ever in Nigeria. We request, we request that Joe Biden, the United States President, disregard the protesters because they are uninformed. In significant parts, the election was free and fair. Those who complain about the election are simply aggressive individuals looking to line their own pockets. According to Daily Post Nigeria, the National Assembly seat among the sensitive areas where the governing APC lost during the elections, the party did not win by a landslide. An election was conducted. An electoral body has announced the winner. The fact that we have a president-elect is inviolable under all political norms. Therefore, stakeholders are expected to embrace the results. Or if not, go to court. And they are in court. And they are in court. So what is now the issue? No, I really want to understand. What exactly is now the issue? What is now the issue? I want to understand something. We can understand what they go on first. Now, Merrick is coming out to tell Biden that the election was free and fair. Say now, Merrick will tell Biden. I'm so sorry to say, when the United States people tell him, I say, then go observe the election. I don't think they needed you to come and tell them after the election, say, see what didn't happen. Because they saw everything that happened, and a good number of them are the ones coming out to say, this election, there is nothing about, there is nothing like free and fair. They know by themselves that this election, there is nothing like free and fair there. The election, no free anything, no fair. They know. So coming out to tell them, then fully observe the election. To me, I will feel we just the fool, we just the fool ourselves. Let me say I go talk. F miracle, not all of us. Okay. APC government became the first basis to beg for congratulatory message. Unfortunately, Biden is not your cool. <laughs> okay, yes, till now, till now, the president of U.S. himself is yet to congratulate the president-elect. And this has not happened in history before. This is the first. This is the first time that this is how many weeks after the election, Biden knew they won't look their face. Hmm? Then they look the president elect face. Okay. Gang of criminals will always support their fellow criminals. Hmm. The writers of this message is completely evil and wicked and crooks and extremely corrupted. Ah. Now miracle she be yes a miracle then write this message. Then send the message to Biden. The, this one is a recognized <laughs> marriage, <laughs> village. I cannot even continue with that statement. The person murdered him. Okay, and the thing is to think that Murik thinks that somebody is going to listen to them. I like their courage and their confidence. You hate us for Islam, we kill you. Okay, you hate us, you hate us for Islam, we kill you. Hopeless person, you remain a reasonable life forever. You will not have peace hence for Sahaba. It never reached like that now. Please, is this all about hatred or lies? How would you feel when somebody steals what belongs to you 
and still persecute you verbally. They need to see what happened during the election. They want to others what you expect to be done to you. I don't expect us to be there. A lot of things I want us to be ignoring in this country. Maybe everything you come as I can't talk or come, yes, come open mouth for. There are some things that are left or best left unsaid. You just do like do you no know, close your eye, do like say you know see him. Now, Miric has never been known for coming out to support what is good. Miric never came outside to come out to come outside to condemn when uh, 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 was it called when the religious war was at its peak. They never came out to say, hey, this you know you no know, good though. See what happened for you. Oh. This one no day okay. They never. I don't think I've ever heard them come outside to say anything good concerning anyone. No, 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 to be very honest with you. This election is the worst in Nigeria history. This political position seeker should have condemned this evil called election before making an appeal to so many mad people in this country. My dear, like I said, Merrick should be aware that these people observed the election. They saw it. Everything that happened, the rape that happened, all the whole magamago, these people saw. But they were within the door of line. We didn't go count APC. Carry a PC party, put for labor, carry labor, put for APC. But they see everything. They also saw it as well. So this one is not a matter of coming out to tell them that it was an election, it was a free election, Keneko Keneko. This is also a case of, I saw it too, sir. Yes, this is also a case of, sir, I saw it too. So you coming out to say this one, you know, be this one. It is now your word against mine. It is now your word against mine. Now, the thing is, the confidence with this Mary will get you. Anyway, I don't really think this Mary is a group because it is only this man I always see. You don't see other people. They don't come outside. And it is only this man. Now, I'm also of the opinion that if this man will come out and be making such statements, this is a man... If this man will be coming out and making uh, such statements, then um, how do I put it? If this man is going to come out and be making such statements, where in the when then they threaten fire and brimstone before the governorship election in Lagos? Immediately after the presidential, immediately they saw that uh, most especially the Lagos state, the um, Labour Party disrupted or chased away, you know, the Jagaban of Bogu from Lagos during the presidential election. They started making statements, you know, go come outside for governorship, you know, go see what thing go happen, make no, no come outside, you know, make no, no do anyhow. He kept quiet till now. He kept quiet till now. Then he's coming out to say the election was free and fair. Anybody who said this election free and fair, may this type of free and fair happen for in life. So I think we'll continue to enjoy him. Since my waiting you want. I'll be now. Alright, so on this note, you've come to the end of the news. We say thank you for turning in to listen. Until I come your way next time, enjoy the rest of your day.